Welcome back, everybody. You know we were talking about uh, sleep loss before the break, and one reason that you might not be sleeping so soundly these days is colon health, because it is Colon Health Awareness Month, and right now, East Cooper, they know all about colon health, and here with information that could save your life is Dr. Margarita Murphy. Doctor, thank you so much for coming back on the program. Thanks for having me. Now, you were here two weeks ago, and you brought a patient who was suffering from some colon troubles as well. Tell us all about her story and where she goes now that she found out that she was going to have to have a procedure. Sure. So this uh, nice lady did the right thing, the thing that everybody's supposed to do. She went and had her colonoscopy at age 50, mm -hmm. and she was found to have a premalignant lesion. So the great thing about colon cancer and precancer lesions is that it's very highly curable right. with just surgery. So on her, we did a very small incision at her umbilicus, and through that we introduced three different instruments, and we were able to remove her colon cancer, her premalignant lesion, there it is. She barely has that teeny little incision, you barely see it. And uh, that's all it took. She was in the hospital for a day and really? a half, and then she was able to go home. And now cancer-free? She's cancer-free. She uh, will be able to live her life without any problems. Which is so fantastic. And when people talk about operating, especially uh, in that kind of vicinity of the body, they must get really nervous, but you can live without a colon and you can live while having the surgery done in those areas. Certainly. I mean, as a matter of fact, sometimes we do remove the whole colon and attach the small bowel to the rectum mm -hmm. and they have a relatively normal life. Um, in the case of Ms. Middleton that we just saw and in the case of colon cancer, we don't even have to go that far. We don't yeah. have to remove the whole colon. We can remove just small portions of it and you're sure not to miss it at all. Yeah, and an early warning is definitely the thing that's going to avoid you from having those surgeries. Absolutely. The truth about it, unfortunately, is that colon cancer does not give you any symptoms. Mm -hmm. Um, if you notice that you have any bleeding or abdominal pain or change in your bowel function or maybe you feel a mass, it may be a little too late for, for us to diagnose your cancer and get away with it with just surgery and you may require more treatment like right. chemotherapy right. or something like right. that. But really, it, again, it's key to make sure you get in there and you get that colonoscopy. Who needs Absolutely. to go and how can you go and get one and sign up? Um, everybody needs to have a colonoscopy at age 50. Age 50, um, so men and women. Men and women, it does not discriminate. Colon cancer attacks everybody the same. Maybe African-American community is a little bit higher risk, so pay attention to that. And you may have to have your colonoscopy earlier and maybe even e earlier if you mm -hmm. also smoke on top of that. But thereafter, if you have some family history, like somebody in your family has had colon cancer, you may need to start earlier, age 40. And if you've had some abnormal colonoscopies in the past, you may need to have them more often than every 10 years. Okay, so where can people find out more about you and your office in East Cooper to make sure that they get in there and take this life-saving step? Sure, you can find us at colonsurgeonsofcharleston.com. You can also look us up at East Cooper Medical Center and on their website and look for your colorectal surgeons. Okay, well, Dr. Margarita, thank you so much for thank being you here so again. Much. We really appreciate you taking the time. You're very welcome, Great thanks. Great to see you again. All right, when we return, honoring our vets in a proud military past over at Patriots Point. Details on an evening to honor Anne Margaret coming up next.